Before you proceed with provisioning the 3M50 thermostat, you should have completed the following tasks. Installed the 3M50 thermostat and tested to make sure it is working correctly as a standalone thermostat. Make sure your Wi-Fi, network, and internet connection is working properly. Have your iPhone connected to your local Wi-Fi network. Installed the USNAP Wi-Fi module and powered back up the 3M50 thermostat. Verified the amber light is blinking. Note, amber light will time out if provisioning is not done shortly after you install the module. You should also copy down the pin number in the upper left hand corner of the screen. It will be used later in the provisioning process. Okay, the first thing we need to do is go to settings, then we'll go to Wi-Fi, and it will show two, it will show our current network, and it will also show your thermostat. So you select the thermostat so it unchecks your current network and che uh, checks out your thermostat network. You then you press the arrow, and it'll show 192.168.10. That's something we don't really care about the last octet, the last number. But we need to see a 192.168.10. And at this point, we've selected it. So we're all set and ready to go from here. The next thing we need to do is go ahead and close the screen. We go to our web browser. Then we need to open up a new page on our web browser. Go to New Page. And then what we're going to do is up there, we're going to enter the IP address shown on the screen, which is that's 192.168.10.1. We'll hit our go. It's going to come up with the radio thermostat and scan for networks. This may take, you know, 10, 15, 20 seconds. Again, this has to be done where your wireless network is connected. It will come up with some different networks. Pick yours. Mine's RNM Innovations. It looks like the correct settings. I got my security mode and everything. Now, here we're talking about security mode. Mine happens to be open. If you have a password to get into your network, this is where you need to enter the password. You then press Next. And we're going to get a password off of the thermostats in the upper left hand corner and it will be different for everyone so we go ahead and it's a numeric and it's five digits in our case it's nine two two five three let me see go ahead and then set the network and it says provisioning is done They've collected all the data that's needed. And you can scroll up and read all about that. Now let's go back to the thermostat. We can see that the green light is flashing, meaning that we're connected. And up in the upper left-hand corner is the last three digits of our IP address. After that, we need to go back to the iPhone and look at it and get it set up so that we can go to our next step. Registering the 3M50 via the Radstat app. This will be shown in our next video.